I know there are some of you that are watching right now that need a miracle in your life. He is the miracle worker. This is just one story, just one story of God's miracle power. I want to share another one with you. This is Dora from Stockton, California. She developed walking pneumonia and her doctors prescribed an inhaler for her to use. Even with the inhaler, her lungs had started closing up on her and it reached a point where she could barely get a word out. Dora called CBN, spoke to a prayer partner who seemed to know exactly how to pray said when she hung up the phone, Dora found that her voice had completely returned and then instantly she was able to breathe easily, deeply and well. She was amazed at the power and the provision of God. I believe God wants you to be amazed at his power and provision and I want to take some time to pray for you and with you today. And let's all join together where two or more are gathered in his name. We don't have to be standing on the same ground but our hearts can be knit together and his presence is with us. So let's pray together right now. Father, even as we watch these stories, hear these testimonies today, we are so aware of your presence, of your heart for us. The Bible says you know even the number of hairs on our heads. And so God, you know the heart cry of every person who's praying right now, every person who's saying, God, I need you in my life, in my body, in my circumstance, in my loved one's life. Will you pour yourself out now, God, in power and in might as only you can do and touch people right at the point of need with your healing power. There's someone who's experiencing deep depression. It's a real darkness and you've not been able to shake it. No medication has touched it. But today God's spoken to your heart and you are set free. I want you to just lift your hands up and begin to praise the living God as you come out of the darkness into his marvelous light. Thank you, God. Thank you. Amen. We want to leave you today with a power minute from Jeremiah 33, 6. I will heal them and reveal to them the abundance of peace and truth. God wants you to live life abundantly. Thanks for being with us. We'll see you again tomorrow.